Hi, I am Lisbeth Asensio, a museum educator at Crystal Bridges Museum of American Art, and this is Bridging the Gap, a series of digital art engagements. In this segment, we will be looking at Professor Benjamin Howard Rand by Thomas Aikens. Before we get started discussing this work of art, let's make sure we have paper and pencil. Now, let's take a few moments to look closely at this piece. Start by letting your gaze wander around the work of art, taking notice of some of the details. Look at the background. What do you see? Do you see the bookshelf? What about the bright green that is between what seems to be a wooden door frame and another piece of furniture? What else did you notice? Did you look at his desk? There are several items on it. What is Professor Wren doing? Yes, he is reading a book and petting his black cat. A portrait tells a story, a story about the subject, what he or she likes, feelings, character, and a lot more. In this particular piece, we can see both professional and personal aspects of Professor Wren. What I would like you to do now is get your paper and pencil and let's do the following activity. Imagine this piece is looking for a pen pal. Write a letter that contains information about Professor Wren. Describe his likes and dislikes, a physical description and information about his home, his family, and his profession. Try and piece together a personality. When you finish writing, if you are with a class, share your letter with another classmate. If you're by yourself, read out loud what you wrote. Please pause the video to give yourself a few moments to write. Were you able to figure out a little more about who Professor Rand is? Professor Rand was Aikens High School chemistry teacher. He also taught at Thomas Jefferson Medical College, which is now known as Thomas Jefferson University. Rand was a popular teacher because he used a hands-on approach to chemistry in the practice of medicine, like doing experiments instead of just discussing theory. On the right side of his desk, we see more of personal objects, like the rose, the black cat, and the pink scarf or shawl that is draped over a chair. This portrait by Thomas Aikens has great significance. It was his first portrait outside his circle of family and friends. It is a precise observation of Professor Wren and his scientific instruments, like the microscope that we see on the left side of his desk. Aikens became one of the most prominent realist painters in America. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this piece as much as I did. This has been Bridging the Gap from Crystal Bridges.